Hi, I'm Ron Kerbis of Ron Kerbis Enterprises. I'm over 45 years experienced on industrial sewing machines. If you're in a rural area and you're far away and you're either in the snow and it's not so nice as here in Los Angeles, California, you may need help. Your problem means that you can't get a mechanic in time. Your livelihood is depending on this machine operating properly. So I offer you a maintenance kit that will help you you order this and you might be out of your problems. Let's go over some of this real fast for you. So okay, we've got a industrial sewing machine, a walking foot style here, compound feeding. The threading is up here. We start here with the threading going through all these three holes here. And then you go down through the first hole, the second hole, and the third hole. Then over this plate, make sure these plates are clean inside of here. There's a wax buildup that comes from the thread, open up, take this off, the spring off and clean the plate, come along here and if you need to then you don't need to clean as much in here. If the thread goes up here and then back down and down through the felt and through the needle here. The other problem that you see on maintenance is that people use too big a screwdriver on this, ruining this small screw and the thread and stripping inside the bar. It has that this machine has the uh, half foot on it, cording foot, so you can go up close to uh, a zipper or a cord. Now, I will tilt this machine backward for you, and we'll talk about the safety clutch here located here underneath the machine. This shaft here drives the hook. The hook could be jammed. On my presentation video, you'll be able to see and my written how to unjam this to take this apart and clean it and get your thread out and get yourself going again. And this is the ball here that goes into this hole here to engage the clutch. If that ever becomes disengaged, you need to re-engage that by pressing the button down, turning the wheel backward, and the ball has to show. All these moving parts need to be oiled, especially this rotating hook. Now if you come over here to this belt here, we have a motor with a pulley, about a two and a half inch pulley. And this uh, up here is maybe like four inches, so the ratio of this to this determines the speed. You can get a smaller pulley. Maybe this can slow you down and help your operator or yourself to control more what you want. Get a smaller pulley and a smaller belt. So we've gone through this machine now. We've shown you the threading. We've shown you the screw for the needle and how to maintain that. We've talked about the clutch underneath. And now if you go to my website, that's where you should go. www.industrialsewingrepair.com you can learn more about me and about this kit. It will be available later in other languages. Thank you.